One thing I never told my wife is that I had a fiance before her. It's a long story, so buckle up. It was the year after I graduated college. I was dating my girlfriend Megan for a couple years, and things were getting serious. At the time, I had my roommate Joey, but he was a Craigslist roommate. We didn't know each other very well. If you ask me how I knew him aside from Craigslist, the answer is I didn't. He wouldn't even tell me where he grew up. Now, no kidding, on the day I was going to propose, tragedy struck. I adorned our apartment with candles and even set up a nice glass display with framed pictures of me and Meg on top. Before Meg came in, Joey walked in and tripped. He actually shattered the glass display and got some in his face. Meg came in a few minutes later as I was on the phone with 911. Fortunately, Meg is a nurse, so she was able to patch him up as the three of us went to the hospital together. Joey would recover, but he had some issues with glass on his face. He needed some cotton gauze inside his eye, which fortunately the doctors were able to save. Clearly, I put off my proposal for the time being, but Meg and I agreed to get married. Our engagement was hush-hush. Meg's hours were wonky, so she took care of Joey when I wasn't around, and I should have seen the red flags, but I ignored them. They'd hang out together with and without me. They'd be in Joey's room and lock the door. One day, I came home and all of Joey's stuff was gone. He moved out. Meg wrote a note. The note said, we fell in love and we're leaving together. Don't try to find us. I didn't listen and I searched, but true to the note, I couldn't find them. I'll never know what happened. But suffice to say, if it hadn't been for Cotton Eye Joe, I'd have been married a long time ago. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Joe?